What's happening guys and welcome back to our channel. If you haven't been living under a rock, then you must surely have heard of Jeffree Star. He's one of the most successful self-made celebrities and an inspiration to many people out there. Here's how Jeffree Star Cosmetics became one of the most popular makeup brands online. Number 4. Jeffree Star Even if you aren't a makeup enthusiast, you might have seen a few of his videos. But there is a backstory behind how he became the most successful from the rest. The star didn't start his career with a makeup company if you can believe it. There's a long life of Jeffree Star before he entered the beauty industry. Jeffree started his social media career by dropping a single on MySpace. This is when he started receiving fame. Although he did drop a single, his passion had always been makeup. And this is indicated when he started playing with makeup products when he was around 13 years of age. He said in one of his videos that he was always been obsessed with Cosmopolitan magazine. He used to read that every month. After taking inspiration from that, he started using makeup by stealing his mother's eyeshadow palettes. It's one of the reasons that even today, the strength of Jeffree Star in his daily makeup videos is his creativity with different eye shades. Number 3. Makeup Jobs Jeffree Star actually pursued his makeup career by working at several makeup counters. He started this in 2002 after he graduated from high school. When he gained enough experience from the makeup stalls, he started doing makeup for other celebrities. He started getting jobs as a makeup artist for fashion shoots and the wedding of celebrities. This way, he got a good command over how to create different looks using makeup and how to do makeup according to the shape of the face. When he gathered sufficient ideas to open up his own makeup line, it wasn't easy. He used up all his savings that he had been collecting from different jobs and he opened up his own e-commerce line. Soon, he started becoming an internet sensation due to his different types of videos. He was posting vlogs and vlogs on MySpace, which gave him a lot of exposure and fame. Other people started following him due to his colorful hair and the plethora of tattoos on his body. People also started liking his unfiltered and candid videos. He used to talk about everything without cutting out any part of his video and therefore people could easily relate to him. Soon, his vlogs started getting removed from MySpace due to some reason but his music video is still there as of today. Although the vlogs started getting removed, by that time he had gotten enough fame that his popularity wasn't even affected by this. Number 2. Music Albums You might not know this, but it's indeed true. Talking about the beginning of his career when he started by releasing his music albums, he started out by making emo electronica music. One of the songs that got released in 2005 went viral and gave him a lot of exposure. He then appeared in other albums which were Sugary Slumber Party in 2007 and Beauty Killer in 2009. After his songs got viral, he got to work with some of the most famous celebrities including Kesha and Nicki Minaj. It was around this time the star climbed the ladder of success and started adding colors to his music videos. The colors in his videos reflected his talent as a makeup artist. Even the selection of his costumes in the music videos displayed his creativity which is the essential factor of becoming a successful makeup artist. His music career didn't stop there. In 2010, he signed a deal with one of the top-notch music artists, Akon, but unfortunately, they couldn't work in the long term due to some major issues. Number 1. Makeup Line During his career of making vlogs and blogs, there were a lot of controversies about Jeffree Star that made him more viral. He addressed all those problems in one of his YouTube videos in 2017 and he's also apologized for it. In his YouTube videos, he also started calling out people and makeup brands which were controversial and were doing unethical things. For example, he pointed out Kylie Jenner for being so expensive for no reason. He pointed out that the makeup products of Kylie are not something new, yet they're very expensive somehow. He then called out one of the rising stars of the beauty industry, which was Huda Beauty. When launching her Easy Bake Powder, she stole the marketing idea of a small-scale beauty company. Jeffrey was the only one to point that out. Then he pointed out Tarte Foundations. When Tarte came out with the foundation range, 
most of them were complimenting the white skin color, and therefore, he called out this discrimination behavior. All these things made him very successful. In 2018, he came out with his makeup line. It instantly blew up the makeup industry due to its unique ideas. The first palette he came out with, he then started making a unique lip formula, which was also a huge success when it debuted. According to Forbes, he made over $18 million in 2018. So do let us know what you guys think about Jeffree Star and whether you're a fan of his in the comments down below. And with that, I'll catch you guys later in another video. Bye now.